Why are robots roaming Biscayne Bay? Every time we are in Biscayne Bay collecting data, taking the robots out there, people, citizens, they ask us, what are these things? What are they doing? These robots can reach regions of the water that we cannot reach that easily. It can collect data like chlorophyll levels that we need, salinity, pH, oxygen levels, and it collects it in a structured way. We also have at our disposal a Department of Defense water tank. Think of a gigantic water tank, taller than me, and we use it to mimic Biscayne Bay. The water can be salty, we can put fresh water, and we can test all these vehicles and the sensor technology we've been developing at scale before we send them to the real world. This is part of our overall goal of monitoring Biscayne Bay, collecting water quality data in near real time and use it for meaningful strategies for policymakers and researchers. We can make informed decisions. We can work together collaboratively to protect these valuable water resources and in a way that can reach a larger audience. Our work is definitely not done. Whatever infrastructure we build for Biscayne Bay, we can extend it to different ecosystems like the Everglades, maybe the ocean. So who knows where we can take this? One thing is for sure, we are working very hard to make this infrastructure really smart.